All right, here we go. Hey, you know what? This place sells cakes too. That's quite the liner. Taxi driver pro tip: It's easier to pick up customers in front of a cake. Yo, no one wants to risk buffing it while lugging around a whole cake. Oh, that's a good point. Which is exactly why I know where all the bakeries are. No idea which are good though. Just when I thought you were finally gonna offer some valuable information. We're really opening up. He knows where all the pastry shops are. We got one, two, three, four, five more to go. Here we go. Oh, hey. The thing's right there. Oh, and right there. Okay. All right. Let's go over here. gamer at some point oh man for sure i used to play tons of genesis and stuff like that genesis what's that an arcade game now nah, it's a home console i think it's called mega drive over japan wait the mega drives called genesis out here mega drive's already a western name so what was the point of rebranding it heck if i know all right Like I've gotten to know them well. Got two bingos. <laughs> Michio figure. All right. Oh, never knew Anaconda had an arcade. I wonder what games they have. Guess I'll check it out when there's time. This one. Oh, 
Alright, alright. If that was worth it or not, ah, no point overthinking it. Kitty cat plush. They want a kitty cat plush. Yeah, I don't see a kitty cat plush in the thing. Oh! Hang on. Dang, everything's so expensive! Thank you very much! Person's in trouble. Let's help. Here we go. You said this place was called Anaconda Shopping Center? It's huge. <laughs> well, it's the biggest shopping mall in Honolulu. They got pretty much all you'd ever need. 
We slowed up on spies. Hmm. Sujiman Sensei. After our last talk, I realized Hawaii's been calling my name. Got something fun to show you. Meet me by the PC shop in the Anaconda Shopping Center. There's bustling street performers and stuff. Guess ukuleles are real popular around here. Guy's even drawing in a whole crowd. He's got the stage to himself. Maybe he's actually a pro. Wouldn't hurt to drop in for a listen. End up staying for the rest of the show. Live music sure is great. Man, am I lucky not every day you can catch Matt Tropico performing at a place like this. Apparently, this is his release party. I hear he's going on tour soon. Maybe I'll buy some tickets. even heavier than I thought it'd be. Ah, don't sweat. Besides, aren't you a famous singer? You got a whole crew working for you, so should you just let them handle it? If you get hurt, you can't play your uke anymore. And if you can't play, it's game over. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you got me there. Uh, yeah, th this event was kind of a rush job, so, so we don't have much staff working it. I, I just didn't want to make any more trouble for them. But that'd defeat the point if I got injured, so yeah. Nah, you're a real nice guy, aren't you? Like, even though you made it big, none of that fame went to your head. And the fact that you're considerate of your staff? Mad respect. <laughs> nah, you're exaggerating. <laughs> Not at all. He's right, you know. Huh? Ah, you're always trying to help us out even after pouring your heart and soul into your performance. Now that the show's over, it's time for us to step up to the plate. Hey, you ought to take a break. Relax. I just feel like there's more I could be doing. But you're right. I should step back. And thank you so much for earlier. It'd be great to see you again at another one of my shows. Yeah, for sure. I'll be looking forward to it. Good luck, man. Nice. All right, so we got that one this way, not that way, that way. Where's the 
trigger. There it is. Oh, I wonder what all the buzz is. Are they filming something here? Sorry if you're trying to get through. You see, we've rented out this place, the entire mall, actually, to film the latest edition of our variety show. Oh, no kidding. Sounds pretty big budget. Oh, yeah, you betcha. It's a special program with a ton of backers. It's called Anaconda Escape. Anaconda Escape. Anaconda Escape, huh? You never heard of it? In Japan, it always draws in viewers by the thousands. Once a year, we rent out the Anaconda Shopping Center and have celebrities participate in what's essentially a huge escape room. I uh, must have slipped my radar. Maybe it's worth watching if it's so popular. I'll have to tune in later. Please do! We're about to start filming the Challengers round. It's for regular folks who want a chance to compete after a rigorous screening process. This year's player is wild. The man's been dubbed Mr. Anaconda. He's so dedicated, he actually built a training course in his backyard just to practice for today. Oh, sounds like quite the spirited. What? Get out of here. Kawamoto-san backed out? Oh, you're seriously telling me this seconds before we start filming? The celebrity shoot is set for next week. There's absolutely no way we can reschedule. No, but my hands are tied. <laughs> that thing hung up on me. Shit. Imara-san, what was that all about? Uh, Onishi-chan. Get this shit. So, you know that guy Kawamoto-san, our participant for the Challengers round? The Mr. Anaconda guy. Yeah? We're gonna start recording a segment now, right? Yeah, about that. Turns out he's been suddenly stricken with gout. Yeah, I can hardly walk. Wait, what? Oh no. How do you get gout? I mean, there's not much we can do about that. I hear gout's excruciating. Ugh. Apparently, he's obsessed with the food here in Hawaii and has been wolfing down shrimp and beer like it's nobody's business. Damn, gout. Unbelievable glut. Uh, well, what's done is done. Whether Kawamoto-san gets better or not, we're down to the wire here. We need a replacement. Stat! Oh, and who do we have here? Oh, him? He was just passing by. I was telling him a little bit about the show. Hmm, not a celeb. At least not that I know of. Pretty fit, too. You know, this just might work. Screw it. Let's do it. Hey, buddy, <clears throat> how would you like to appear on Anaconda Escape as our new challenger? For me? Yeah. yeah. Wait, do you really be okay with that? What happened to that rigorous screening process or whatever? I'd be skipping right over that. Not at all, my good man. Based on my impeccable producer's instinct, you pass with flying colors. Congratulations, friend. Please give it a chance. We only have today to record this segment. There's no, there's no going back. Will you do it? Will you rise to the challenge? Perhaps a luxurious prize would sweeten the pot. I, I don't know. Prizes aside, I don't know the first thing about this game. Huh, starting from scratch, are we? Well then, allow me to explain. Put simply, it's an escape room, complete with riddles at every turn. One reviewer said, your game of cat and mouse through a maze-like mall. Make your dashing escape towards the goal and claim a fancy prize. <laughs> Easy enough and tons of good fun. Hmm. All right. Wow. How do we do this? Sound like a good thrill, but uh, who exactly is going to be chasing me? Ah, take a look over there. Oh. Some kids from the local college track and wrestling teams, they help out every year. Uh, just a heads up, each one is a beast in their own right. I can see that. So those are the guys I'm up against? Well, yeah, it's no fun if it's too easy. You gotta put the pedal to the metal for that prize. Don't worry, there are tons of escape strategies available. You just have to use that noggin a little. It's hmm. a guaranteed blast once you get going. Okay, then. Looks like I'm in for a wild ride. We're counting on you, Challenger. <clears throat> uh, what was your name 
again? It's Kasuga. Kasuga-san! Brilliant! I'm Imada, the producer. Seems our meeting was an act of fate. All right. So then, Kasuga-san. Ready to tackle Anaconda Escape? Sure, why not? I'm ready. It sounds cool, so I'm going all in. Oh, you're the best. I owe you one. Though, full disclaimer, I'm just a regular guy. I don't know the first thing about acting, so not exactly TV material, you know? Ah, nothing to fret over. Our show's selling point is unfiltered entertainment. Don't worry about looking good for the cameras. Just get out there and enjoy yourself. Ah, with that, Onishi-chan, I leave the rest to be explaining to you. I've got to get everything else set up. Okay, explain it to me. Right, let me go over the finer details. Yeah, that'd be great. Here's the long and short of it. Uh, what it sounds like. An escape room set within the corner shop and your goals reach goal before the enemies reach you. While completing missions along the way, you have exactly six minutes to reach goal. Back up a sec. What are these missions you yes. have planned? We place laptops in containers all through the mall. Laptops give you quizzes to solve, whereas containers need keys or passwords to unlock. Let me just get a... Uh Let's do this. Go. 
No! Dang it. Alright, this is gonna be a win. That's 20 second penalty. Dang. Luki. No! Dang it! So I went here for nothing. Oh, jeez. Completed it at least. Once again, Kasugasan, fantastic job. You're our totally random last minute pinch hitter, but you really delivered. You really put up a <coughs> Kasugasan. Watching your nail biting escape efforts made my palms all sweaty. I'm just glad I made it to the goal. I wish I could have done more quizzes and stuff, but I wasn't really sure I had the time. Yeah, it definitely takes smarts and speed to get through it. But nice job, you really outdid yourself. We captured plenty of great material for the show. You really saved our hides. As promised, here's your prize. As far as I can tell, this broadcast is gonna be a smash hit. A new star's been born among our challengers. I think so too. So, about next year's show... Mr. Anaconda Reborn versus Gentle Giant Kasuga-san! Oh, wouldn't that send ratings through the roof? That's pure genius! Shall I start drafting a proposal? Whoa, wait, wait, guys. I'm just a stand-in. Plus, I'm sure more people out there want to compete. Might as well give them a fair chance, right? Hmm, that's certainly true. You're a good guy, Kasuga-san. But if you're ever interested, we'd love to have you again. I'm sure the production team will snatch you up right away. Maybe one of these days, but for the time being, I'm gonna hold off. What? Yeah, I know Yonakura. He's our cyclist for the televised journey across America. What do you mean he's got hemorrhoids? They're so bad he'd bleed out the second his ass touches a bicycle seat? Oh my goodness. But that's supposed to follow hot on the heels of Anaconda Escape. Hey, Kasuga-san. You like bikes, right? I think I've had enough travel for now. Thanks. Oh. Well, we did it. We didn't get all the stuff, but... Let's get it done. I won't hold that. 
Looks like I'm up. That's picking time. Dang, we're up to a thousand again. Oh, this is going to be another buddy.